Hello and welcome to this third training video about the Visual Communication Planner. You have already defined the top of your mountain, your goal. You need to know if and how you are reaching your goal, especially in this digital world, you need to define KPIs. KPI stands for Key Performance Indicator. It is a type of performance measurement used to evaluate the success of a particular activity. In web marketing, it's very important to distinguish between metrics, KPIs and goals. For example, acquiring more followers on Instagram is for sure not a goal. It could be a KPI if you are an influencer. In reality, it's a metric or a fancy sounding metric or a vanity metric if you prefer. But it is just a number with no meaning if you don't combine it with two more dimensions. A KPI should always be determined by a metric, a source channel and a time span. So if your goal is, for example, obtaining requests for proposals, a KPI to measure it could be the number of field form on your website from a specific activity in a time span of, let's say, 90 days. That could be a great KPI for a B2B company, a business that sells to other businesses. The Visual Communication Planner gives you a journey for your marketing strategy, as well as questions to be answered and completed. Here are some questions to help you determine your KPIs. What are the business metrics aligned to the goals? Sales, contracts, appointments, etc. What are the channel metrics to consider? How will you measure these metrics? How often should you analyze the traffic? What tools do you use to analyze the results? What can you do if the goals are met or not met? You can find all these questions on the official website as well. Let's start setting an example for the whole strategy. For a B2B company, it is easy. Goal, request for proposals for, from manufacturing companies, for example. KPI, request for proposals from each channel on the internet in a time frame of 90 days. A more consumer focused example could be a goal, downloads of the app on the App Store or the website. KPI, we can divide the KPI in two, so KPI A, the number of downloads from specific channels in 30 days. We can also track the visits to our websites from specific channels in 30 days. Now that you have set your goal and your KPI, you are ready to the next step of the plan. Channels and activities. And remember the old saying, what gets measured gets done. See you in the next video and happy climbing.